Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to the top free assets for October, November 2024, where I feature some of the best models, tools, environmental assets, editor extensions, and everything you can find in Unity for absolutely free for this month. I'll put all the links down in the description along with all the months you might have missed. Do be sure to check out my Patreon to get over 225 different scripts, assets, and projects you cannot find anywhere else and check out Unity's $20 sale and there's a few new ones on Humble Bundle with some massive asset bundles with crazy reductions. So first one here, we've got the Vegetation Stylized Kit, which has a bunch of vibrant trees, bushes, flowers and herbs with 10 different trees, 8 bushes, 7 flowers and 6 herbs, all in a very vibrant style. We've got the screen space reflections for URP. So screen space reflections aren't supported out of the box in URP. And this uses optimized algorithms to make this work. And you can make reflections look much more realistic in real time compared to what you would use in reflection props. We've got the water stylized shader with orthographic and perspective cameras. And as I said, it's designed to work in both orthographic and perspective modes. And you can customize various details about this, including color, wave strength and you can make alternatives to this make things look like slime or like lava if you want to customize the look next one is the dynamic mesh slicer which is a powerful asset which allows you to slice at runtime and it has various different types this can be used in static or skin meshes and you can even generate clean water type meshes after you've sliced something and you can even see this done in the unity inspector too we've got the fake fog this is always really useful to create an atmosphere or block out edges of something when you've got big terrains or something like that. This does include things like ground fog, fog rings, and advanced terrain fogs, even particles with god rays, and other advanced features, which is highly optimized and suitable for even nighttime ambience. We've got the Fantasy Kingdom demo for Unity 6. This is for educational purposes only, and I do have a full video on this, but it uses Cinti's Fantasy Kingdom assets and it has all the integrated new Unity features, the best optimization. We've got Color Studio, which is an extension for creating color palettes and pixel art in the very easiest way possible. So you can texture and author sprites by mirroring, rotating, zooming, panning, and having all the different design tools you can have using texture voxelization. You can have palette creation, big editor extension, and you can even have dynamic colors and it works across all pipelines. Next one is the Monster Bear Free. This is a low poly bear character with a weapon, which has idle, walk, run, strike animations, hurt, and death, all around 2,000 triangles. We've got the Retro Wave Skies Light, which is dynamic skybox pack suitable for URP. And this is a full skybox shader. You can customize the parameters and the features. It uses neon grid shaders. You can create these dynamically as loads of pre-made textures VR support. We've got the Time Ghost environment and the Time Ghost character, which is available for free. Again, for educational purposes, which is a HDRP template, GPU based approach to handling interactions and brand new scenario blending, adaptive pro volumes and everything that's incorporated in new Unity 6 features for HDRP. We've got the projectile curve visualizer, so you can use this in third person so you can aim and throw projectiles. You can have this as top tower tower defense, any sort of thing so you can visualize even if you want to be able to jump and use this for various other features. And I did create a video on showing you how you can make a grenade throw just like this with the arc throw, throwing a grenade and blowing things up. We've got Project Browser Pro, so you can add back and forward buttons on the Unity browser, cycle through selection history. You can display additional things in asset size, type and extensions. You've got customizable quick save slots, customizable hotkeys, loads of different updates to keep this fresh and usable. We've got grass and moss decals pack across all pipelines and it's 45 procedurally generated grass and moss details which are up to 2k in resolution which really help you add that differentiation to some of your assets that you might use on your terrain. We've got the Zombie Cartoon Low Poly, which is a mobile and PC friendly about 5,000 triangle model and it includes 2,000 resolution and textures too. So do be sure to check out all these assets that I featured and over 100 that are free for this month. I'll put all the links down below so you don't miss out a thing. Be sure to check out on the Unity Asset Store the $20 sale and the rest of the humble bundles that have appeared with a massive collection of assets at a crazy reduction. And do be sure to check out my Patreon too to get over 225 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Big thank you to all my patrons. Special thank you to Peter Steiner, 
Jennifer, and Varishutha for their amazing support, and thank you for coming to watch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.